happy days at Porsche Cincinnati Kings. Uh, we captured a 2018 Porsche Cayenne e-hybrid and it really did get excellent upkeep uh, over the course of its uh, uh, servicing history here. Uh, it has really a, a neat or aggressive Michelin uh, tire on it for uh, probably all season handling and there are approximately 153,000 or so miles. Uh, we do have both keys and the ownership material. It's super clean in here. I mean, it feels and looks like a vehicle uh, that might have 30,000 miles on it, and I'm not kidding. So uh, I just know the, the previous owners to be very particular about their upkeep. Uh, and they're servicing and they did uh, secure a new Porsche and this is going to be a, a really nice acquisition for someone. So again the interior very clean. Uh, look at the seat wear on the, the driver's seat. Again this there's 153,000 miles on this Porsche and I just don't think uh, you, you know you, you understand how you can keep a, a vehicle this nice. Uh, but I think if you're just on top of it, uh, it can happen. Let's see one little uh, kind of, that could maybe get a little bit of glue or something along that lines. Okay. And then on the uh, plug-in e-hybrids, you have uh, uh, a gas port and you have an electric port. And they did have the all-weather mats, the trunk liner. You've got the charging equipment. Uh, you really are kind of set and ready to go. Even uh, the wheels, they've uh, taken care to uh, remedy any or most kind of any curb rash or anything like that. So uh, I would tell you that the expectations uh, just getting in, driving this particular model, uh, the, the tire and tread depth is where you want it. Uh, you probably will do uh, uh, some some brakes front and rear over the next 10, 20,000 miles. Uh, other than that, uh, it's, it's going to be smooth sailing. Reach out to Michael Anthony with Porsche Cincinnati Kings, and we can provide you more details on the 2018 Cayenne e-hybrid.